It is now 6.45, time for traffic and weather together with meteorologist Shay Sorensen. Shay, there is absolutely nothing normal about this Thanksgiving except, and I can't believe I'm saying this, our weather has now become <laughs> average for this time of year. I know. What's going on? I know, finally near normal, and it's all thanks to a system that's passing by to the north of us. Uh, that's what brought the breeze yesterday, too. A light breeze from that system can be expected for today as it continues eastward, so just keep that in mind. But temps right now, uh, similar to yesterday, but colder in some spots, too. Places like Sierra Vista, Bisbee, uh, areas to the south and east, a little bit colder. Waking up to 54 at the Tucson International Airport, or Valley, low 40s, low 50s from Marana, Sierra Vista, low 40s in Bisbee too. Summer Haven, cold at 28 degrees this morning. For your highs today, finally near normal in the upper 60s and low 70s across the metro Tucson area. West wind at 5 to 15 miles per hour. And then overnight tonight, even colder. Temps dropping into the 30s and 40s. So definitely bundle up for your Wednesday morning. To the south and east, mainly in the 60s today. So uh, with that breeze, it'll feel a little bit colder. So you're probably going to want a jacket with you throughout the day. 69 for Green Valley, 71 for cells and 70 in Ajo. As we make our way towards tomorrow and Thanksgiving, we're going to be between two systems, so temps will warm up just slightly, but still close to average. And then really cold air will make its way towards us on Friday, pushing our dropping our highs into the low 60s on Friday. So that means 50s and 60s all across southern Arizona. So getting pretty cold. Unfortunately, though, all the moisture with these systems will stay well to the north of us. The coldest morning we're going to have will be Saturday morning with temps dropping into the 20s and 30s, so keep that in mind too. Warming back up into the low 70s Sunday and Monday.